Hey, what is happening? What is going on? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, thanks for stopping by. And if you haven't subscribed, smash that subscribe button. But let me show you five interesting ways to use Chat GPT AI in Blender. So let's jump into Chat GPT. First thing you can do is say surreal image ideas in Tender 3D and then you can see it's starting to give me some ideas for images. If you're having a artistic block or that kind of stuff, you can use JGPT to come up with some ideas. And there we go. That's 10 ideas for new images to create. So, second thing we can do, go here, or we can go new chat. You can say, write me a Python script to make 200 cubes dice to each other but not touching and there we go write your code Okay, and then all you do is take copy code. Oh yeah. And then you just go general like normal. Oh yeah. Takes it at some new control V. You just paste it and you run it. Alright. Then the next thing you can do is ask ChatGPT to make an add-on. Yeah, make a blender add-on that creates a cube with a sub division surface modifier. And here we go. Okay, now this summit didn't work, but if you keep trying, it will work. Even if you just modify the the words, trust me, there's videos on it. I think I put it in the description where you can see someone do it. So check that out. But it is possible, trust me. Next thing, if you're a YouTuber making Blender videos, you can say Blender 3D YouTube video ideas. You just wait for it to load. You can check here stories and creativity models, walkthroughs, tips and tricks for optimizing performance and reducing render times. Great video idea. Maybe I'll use it. And there we go. 10. So this, they don't even give you one. ChatGPT gives you 10. Same for the video ideas, the photo ideas. So yeah, use this if you want. Last one, number five, is you can use ChatGPT specific questions. So how to make cross in Blender. Okay, let's see what happens. And then start spitting out facts. And there we go, showing you how to make grass. So if you want to follow that, you can. Some people like to watch videos, but you can also use it for that. So that's five tips to use ChatGPT in Blender. I'm going to make more videos like this on using AI in Blender. So hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, smash the like button. And I'll see you next one.